Are you filming now? Yeah. Okay. Uh, is it Monday? Yeah, it's Monday. Okay. Hello. Welcome to Monday. I didn't mention anything about it, but... <laughs> Ta-da! Look, magic. Yay. Movie magic. I've come in. This is a green screen. <laughs> I'm not really here. Whoa! Whoa! The tracking, Steven. Yeah, yeah I've, I've gotten really good at making it appear. Actually, I was getting a shower and I walked out and Tom's was just here. And I was like... Just and Dan. Yep, and I was here. Well, Dan's always here, so that so wasn't a surprise. <laughs> Dan lives here. Did I live that? here. He lives under the couch. Um, I was gonna say the garage, but okay. It's warmer in here. Let's make it less um, Thomas, I'm told Thomas brought gifts because when I came out, like Dan was like opening things. Thomas has brought us gifts. I have a gift. People have already opened gifts, but you don't have. Yeah, well, I was a little late. You're late. I mean, doing your doing your do. You're clean now. You look very nice. Thanks. I took you, a shower. I'm glad that you dressed up. To today. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to do You're that. You're all made up. Well, because my house is full of crap and I have too many things. And I'm like, I don't want these things in my house anymore. I know someone who will take these things from me. And that's Mr. Stephen George here today. It's true. Um, I will put your crap in my house. Yeah, mail it to him at uh, Blank Street Taco Bell. Um, because you did a, a video <laughs> game from 1996? Yeah, something like that. Look, it's a magnet of Bowser from 96. Oh my god. Flip it over. Look at Bowser's name. <laughs> B-O-U-S-E-R. Boozer. Boozer. Cool. <laughs> Murrow, it me, Boozer. <laughs> That's him freaking fire. That's a video game, but it's a 3D... 3D? Mario? This is pretty neat. It is pretty cool. Where did you get this? Uh, I ordered off that, I'm sorry. I didn't, really <laughs> I didn't really own that, but I'm like, you know what? Oh, I, I was just like... Somewhere you were in you know, Topeka, Kansas in 96, and you're like, what? And then you got it. Mm -hmm. And then I sold it to myself on Etsy. <laughs> I wonder if it would stick to the fridge in the packaging. It might. Do it now. <laughs> Solid. I ain't got to open that. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> the Ledger's edition. There you go. So when it's super valuable and never. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm sure. Yeah. We'll see. Well, you do that video game. Look, you got the Fallout Man. Mm -hmm. You got two Fallout Mans. Yeah, I got Fallout Man. Yeah, him. Him. <laughs> him. So you, do, you do the Fallout Man, and like, um, it's it's. You can't look at that one. That's a surprise. Um, you do the Fallout Man, and I I collect toys because I'm a grown ass child, um, and I'm way into these. Uh, and Dan's got one too, but it's a cool little, um, little, little guy. It's super cool. It's, it's the X01 armor. Yeah, and you can trade the parts out. That's neat. So you can collect them all. My friend, I looked at him and was like, but he only got one arm. And then I realized, oh, you put the arm You in. put the arm on, and you can get many and put them all together. Available at GameStop. Thank you, Thomas. You're yeah. welcome. Yeah, this is the armor I use in the game. Because it's the best. It is the best one. It's the best armor. There you go. And you'll probably be a reasonable adult and never open it. And there it will stay for the rest of his life. Where do I put it right now? It fine right there. It fine. You're, I think killed an angel. <laughs> you're never going to look at that again. It's okay. I need to move. It's fine. She's good. Everybody. She's fine. What is it? Where did that come from? I don't know. Okay. Your mom put it there. It's like, he needs angels in his life. <laughs> the angel needs to be guarded by armor. Anyway. Anyway, you had a you had a birthday, right? Uh, yes. You're an, you're an old... I didn't actually know. That's okay. That's fine. Ma, uh, Mal told me. Cool, nice. Because what year is it? 2018. Cool. When did you, uh, I'm gonna say in like 2012 you got the book Steve Jobs, right? Mm, mate. Sure. Right? It was right. 2011. 20, I, 2011. Oh, <laughs> probably. Yeah. I'm being generous to you. So yeah. it's, it's been seven full years and you've not read that yet, have you? Uh, define read because I've read some. Like finish the book. I have read the, the end. I did not read the middle. Did you read it on Wikipedia? No. 
Yes, yeah. That's what I'm assuming you did. You just read the three thousand. I haven't, I haven't read the book. You've not read the book. Well, no. you know, it's because it's a big book, right? And it's hard to read. It right? is hard to read. It's hard to read. It so has a lot of words. It's got t too many and like no pictures at all, right? No, I looked for the pictures first. <laughs> like, it's got like, to <laughs> be because sometimes the books they in the middle they got the nice. Yeah. On pages and they're full color and it's like this is what happened on the first page and I'm like okay I got it <laughs> but that wasn't in okay. there well because you're a grown ass man and you need to read a book I got you the kids version of the book it's called Who Was Steve Jobs <gasps> and it's, it's got lots of pictures and everything so I think you can finish that one. <laughs> Now I'll finally know. We'll finally know what happened to him. Because I don't know who that was. Did he get off the island? <laughs> Did he invent the phone? Oh, well, he invented tools. <laughs> California. <laughs> he founded California. Oh, wow. He starred in Toy Story. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, great. Amazing. This one gets to be front and center, so I'll read it. My job's done. Bye, everybody. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God, it's scary now. <laughs> it was a little terrifying. I heard some sounds, and so I'm going to live in here instead. Goodbye. Thomas has never been to Mission. What do you think? Because you, you're a barbecue boy. Thomas grew up in South Carolina where barbecue was important. I mean, the banner for it is okay. Um, you know, I'm so used to it just like the barbecue's finished, like you don't need to add anything to it. It's good though. Like, if, if you want like a variety, yeah, it's worth it. But like, you want good barbecue. You gotta go to like the nowhere town that, you know, it's a hog, you know, once a week and it's, you know, finished with that. But for this, so it's all right. <laughs> Thomas. Thomas. <laughs> You guys don't, do they know about that thing? I don't, I don't know if I've ever actually shown it. No, I mean, it's, <laughs> you put this, it's a toupee. You put a toupee it's on a toupee. it. <laughs> you put like googly eyes. Oh, <laughs> yes. Is what becomes its own person, or it's like, <laughs> like I'm like, what the hell are you doing? And I'm like, is this a lucky rabbit foot, or is this like a hunk of fur that you sleep with when you take a nap? <laughs> but no, I mean, I understand. <laughs> it's the way of the viewfinder. Like they don't even know. They don't know. They don't. They don't have to know. It's great. <laughs> You don't know when they see it in person. You have a special Pax pocket East. for it. I can't get over this. After lunch, we came over to the mall because uh, Thomas had some trade and stuff, and I'm like, oh yeah, we'll go. We'll go to Player's Choice. See Roland. Uh, we picked up some GameCube games, and we came out here, and I was like, oh, and a film like a little goodbye for Thomas, and I don't think I've ever shown it. I have this little pouch, and it holds a dead, a miniature dead cat, a miniature wind filter that sticks to the top. It's not made of cats. It's well, they're called dead cats, and they you know, stick up to the top of the camera, so whenever there's wind, it doesn't affect the the, the, audio, the audio. I started using one in August. Uh -huh. I never, I don't think I ever talked about it. Anyway, I just like went into my little pouch, and Thomas started losing it. <laughs> he was like, "It's your camera has a little toupee." <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I can actually. I could probably show it uh -huh. if I just did like. Can I, can you see it? Just take it off and show them. <laughs> oh, they can probably see it. Oh my god. There's a little, yeah, you can see it. There's a little toupee. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And that's fine. Thomas, you... People Tom can't tell that it's fake, right? <laughs> <laughs> it looks real, right? Yeah, well, it's just, you know, I need it because it's windy. Is it? Yeah, right, this would totally destroy the audio. It would sound like that, and now it doesn't sound like that. Because of this little oh, thing. I gotta clean the screen. Clean the do you know what? Do you know what this is called? You said it was a dead cat. Well, you, the brand. What's the brand? Micro Muff. <laughs> I'm not making. Goodbye. Yeah, I'm not making that. <laughs> Just leave the stuff you bought. And I ran, I ran so far away. 
it's always fun hanging out with Thomas, and um, it's really weird seeing him or a lot of our friends who don't live around here because it doesn't feel like it's been as long as it has since I've seen him because we play games together on Saturday nights. Mm -hmm. So I talk to Thomas pretty frequently, and then I, when I get, see him in person, I'm like, oh, I, it actually has been quite a while since you know we've been together, but it was fun to see him, and we'll probably see him again this summer. So that's exciting. Uh, for dinner, um, we have got the Korean beef bowl. That was not the plan at all. We were going to be doing like fish or something. Chicken and asparagus. Oh, chicken and asparagus. And um, at the last second, Mouse said, no, we have all this stuff to make this and I want this. And I was like, all right. One thing that's different is that we didn't have any spinach. So instead of using spinach, we had bok choy. Because we had picked up some bok choy. We liked it the last time we made it, so we're like, yeah, we'll pick it up, and then we ended up using it for this, so nice little change. Does it work well with it? Mm -hmm. Is it pretty much the same as the spinach? It's a little... It's a little different. Yeah. Okay. It's mm. good, though. I'm excited. Um, we've already finished uh, quite a bit. I finished up all the Morning Mario I need to give to Dan. That means that I will be able to give Dan everything he needs. At this point, the only stuff that's remaining that I have to do is falling on me, which is Fallout. So um, over the next few days, I've got to record and edit a ton of Fallout, but I'll work on that tomorrow. So I'm going to wrap it up here and say thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?